My name is Chef Fernando with LearnToCook.com. So today we're going to do a, a quick sandwich, uh, something really easy, something really fun to do. Um, doesn't take a lot of uh, time or a lot of ingredients to make, so we're going to play around with some uh, fun ingredients. We're going to start off with a cucumber and mint sandwich, something really easy that you can do for a, a quick snack. You can also do it for a, um, a, a get-together or uh, watch the game or whatever it is. It's really easy, really simple snack. And for that, what we're going to use is we're obviously going to use some bread. We're using wheat bread right uh, for today. But you can feel free to use any other type of bread you want. Uh, we're going to use, obviously, some cucumber, some cream cheese, some butter, and then some mint. Um, so really straightforward. We're also going to use a paper towel, which we'll explain in a little bit as to why. Uh, and so we're going to start building it. And we're going to start off by chopping the mint. And these are only the leaves, and the leaves only. So we pick these out of the, uh, the bunch of mint. And we're only do using the leaves. Um, so we're gonna go ahead and, and put them together in a little bunch, and we're gonna finely, finely slice them really, really nice and fine. You don't want to over chop this because what happens is if you over chop the mint, the oils start to get released, and what will happen is the uh, the mint will actually start to turn black, and you're gonna lose a lot of that freshness. Um, so once that's done, we're gonna throw that into our mixing bowl. We're going to combine that with the cream cheese and the butter. And uh, the butter and the cream cheese, we've softened them previously, so th they're soft already. Um, that will be a lot easier to mix together. Um, so once we have that, we're going to peel the cucumber. And um, here's where the paper towel comes in. It's, it's a quick and easy trick you do in order to uh, make it easier for cleanup and to continue to build up. You want to put a paper towel on your cutting board or your cutting table, and you're going to peel the cucumber on top of that. And so what happens is the peel stays in the in same space, and then also it doesn't uh, get the, the, the cutting board or the, or the um, counter dirty. So it, it makes for easier cleanup. So once we peel the cucumber, we're going to slice it up. And uh, so as you can see, now we're done with the done with that. We can just go ahead and remove these and our table or, or cutting board and our, or it's pretty clean. So we're going to slice it up into uh, lengthwise into about a quarter of an inch thick. Um, you can do it bigger if you want. You can do it uh, smaller. It's up to you, but it's pretty decent size. And uh, we're using English cucumber uh, as opposed to the regular cucumber. Uh, look, you can also known as um, seedless cucumber. So we don't have to worry about removing the seeds. These are totally edible. Um, uh, so it's, it's easier to work with. Um, so once we have those cut, we're going to mix the, the, the cream cheese and the, and the butter and the mint together. You want to scrape the sides too here, making sure that um, you get all of it very evenly combined and, and, and um, you don't get chunks of butter or chunks of cream cheese or, or mint anywhere. So once that is combined, we're going to go ahead and start building up the sandwich. Again, really easy, really simple to do. Um, Takes no time at all, really. So we have our, our, our bread. Again, we're using wheat bread, but you can use you know any other type of bread that you that you like. It's it's really up to you. Uh, but we're gonna spread the the cream cheese and the mint evenly on the bread. I'm going to do that on both of the breads, both of the slices of the bread. So once that is done, we're going to 
place the slices of cucumber on one of the slices of the bread. And then, of course, we're going to cover the, the, the bread. And finally, what we're going to do is we're going to remove the edges of the sandwich and just the crust, just for a little bit of better presentation. Uh, you don't have to if you don't want to, but it's just for a little bit of a better presentation. So we're going to cut the edges. And then finally, we're going to cut the sandwich in uh, diagonals, and you're ready to enjoy your sandwich. Um, so really, really simple, really straightforward. Um, like I said, not a lot of ingredients, not a lot of uh, time to, to prepare, um, and you can enjoy this pretty, pretty fast after you've done it. So thank you for joining us today. Again, my name is Chef Fernando with LearnToCook.com, and uh, we hope to see you next time. Thank you. Well, thanks for joining us today at LearnToCook.com. Be sure to comment and to subscribe. Also, visit us on Facebook and Twitter. Have a great day, and thank you.